Hey guys, welcome back. So today, I brought you back outside. I know we haven't been outside in a while, guys, but we're back outside today. I wanted to show you guys the kicker sub. I got it in the same box, it's right here. I got it in the same box, sealed box. So we're not gonna get probably quite as loud as it might, but we're gonna see how loud it gets. I got a dB meter in the car. It's not the best in the world, it goes up to 130 dB. And let's get going, let's try it out. Let's see what it does first in the trunk. I'm gonna throw some test tones at it and then I'm gonna go back in the car and we're gonna throw some more test tones at it. here oh give it a little bit more volume now oh, that thing's jamming jamming oh now we don't have the SMD hooked up, so I have no idea if it's clip. I don't think it's clipping. It sounds really clean. All right, so let's do. Let's try 32. Let's try 32 hertz. Mix and match your favorites at uh, Domino's. Commercial. Choose any two or more items for $5.99 each. Order now at Domino's.com. Towards the night before Super Bowl, and I'm back. Montana and Rice live their own glory, adding Doritos to the soup. Here we go. Whoa. Bring it down a little bit. I gotta say, this thing is going like crazy. Still going. I turned it down a little bit. All right, we're gonna bring you in the car and see what happens in the car. I'll be right back. All right, so I got the meter on. Let's see, we're inside the car now. I'm gonna run the same test tones I just did. See what we get for some volume here. Why didn't we stuff Reese's Take Five with five flavors? Let's because go 32 you can't again. Handle... See if we can get any volume out of 32 hertz. Well, not bad for the kicker in a sealed box. Now we're gonna try a musical simulation. Anything's moving outside here. I can't really see anything moving. That doesn't mean that it's not. I can hear my car moving on the outside. Nah, I don't think she's strong enough. Well, guys, back to the old school. If you haven't already, go down below, hit that. Thumbs up guys, make sure you like the video, 
Go right down below that. Smash that subscribe button, guys. We'll see you in the next video. Peace. Any questions or comments, guys, drop them down below. I got a giveaway coming up soon. Power Acoustic Gothic GW124. Come on, get it. Hey, guys, we're back with the kicker. Comp C, 12-inch. We're going to do a few test tones. We got her free air right now. We're going to see what she looks like free air. We're not going to push it. We're not going to be clipping the speaker. We're not going to be blowing speakers. We're just going to throw some nice tones at it and let it ride. Try 30. Oh, there we go. That's really moving, too. All right, now this is going to be a mix from 26 to 52 hertz, 26 to 52 hertz. So it's gonna be a wide range and the sub's gonna be really, really flexing. The wide different range of motion. We're gonna do these a couple free air tests, and then we're gonna put it in the in a sealed box and see how she does in the sealed box. We're gonna do one more free air. It's 32 hertz and up. That's what this song is. 32 hertz and up. There we go. Now when I do the the box test, I'll throw the dyno on it also. I'm going to give it RMS power when I do the test. All right, guys, if you haven't already, make sure you throw that thumbs up. Whoa. Go down below, hit that subscribe button, guys. We'll be right back. Hey, guys, welcome back. We got the Kicker Comp C12, Kicker Comp 12. We're going to start with a 40 hertz syntone, sine tone. Let's go. Mm -hmm. at about 23 watts right now and that thing is rumbling my whole house I'll just put it that way it's a sealed box and in different parts depending on where you stand it sounds dope and we're running at almost 11 ohms 23 watts so let's see how 30 Hertz sounds mm -hmm. There's 30 hertz, and we got 44 watts of power. Definitely nowhere close to an RMS for this subwoofer. And we're still at almost 7 ohms. Maybe the musical will do better. All right. Let's try a music simulation and go. Try 80 watts. 
watts there. 125. I gotta say, for a little kicker, it don't sound that bad. Sounds really good. pushing it now. All right. Hey guys, make sure you don't forget to throw that thumbs up. Go down below. Hit that subscribe button, guys. All right, guys. So we're back. I got it back in the house now. We're going to do the same tones. I got it on a different amp. It's on the JBL GTX 500. I want to see if it just made any difference in excursion or sound wise. Let's see what happens. All right, we're going to start off with 40 hertz. So it should be 4 ohms. This is single 4 ohms. So we're going to do a 32 hertz. See what happens. Three, two, one. 115. So we got a little bit more there. All right. Now we're going to do a simulation of a song. Here we go. Get him, kicker. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure you throw that thumbs up, guys. If you're not a current subscriber, what are you waiting for? No clipping, huh? All right. Let's try one more test. I'm gonna to go to 50 hertz and see if we can get more power out of it. Let's see. Trying to get more power. All right. And we're off. All right, we'll be right back. All right, guys, so that was the kicker, kicker comp.
Kicker Comp C, 12 inch, single 4 ohm subwoofer. It didn't actually perform all that bad. It didn't. It did pretty well, honestly, for a single 4 ohm in a sealed box. It did really well. I was actually surprised. It. I think in the car it did like 126 dB. That's not bad for a couple hundred watts on a single 4 ohm subwoofer, guys. So, guys, if you haven't already, make sure you go down below, show some support, hit that like button, guys. Go down below if you're not a subscriber already, guys. Now's the time. Go smash that subscribe button. We're going to have a giveaway for a Power Acoustic Gothic subwoofer. I know I tried doing it before, but I'm going to do it again, and this time we're giving it away for sure. It's going to be a quick one. All right, guys. We'll see you next time. Take care of yourselves and each other. Peace.